An additional charge of fraud amounting to 21 million rand has been added to the charges faced by the 15 accused. Other charges include attempted murder and murder. The suspects include former university staff and staff members who were on suspension facing disciplinary hearings. Now regarding the people inside, of course there are big surprises. There's disappointment, there's a sense of betrayal that we feel by some of the people here. We're in positions of trust uh, with us, uh, either as service providers or as staff members. I just want to address one thing, because this is coming up now. Yes, some of the people are from the university, but half only. The rest, the rest are from outside. The ones from the university, the majority of them, were already outside the door. Either they were under, either suspended or already dismissed. Okay, we were already acting. As a matter of fact, two of them that are inside, their DCs were supposed to sit this week. To date, a total of 25 people have been arrested in cases related to murder at the university. The police ministry is pleased with the manner in which the case is going. It's quite a high level of people, people that are registrars, uh, HR and all that. So for now, we're at the very beginning, so maybe it's okay to give time for the, the, for the teams to continue to do the work. As I've said, that it doesn't matter where they come from, whether university, whether Deben, or whether where. Ours is to do our job and just prove that we have a case with the team, teams that we're very much trusting that they're doing a good job. Mm. The state is expected to oppose the bail application due to the serious nature of the charges faced. Abungile Yankees, SABC News, Dimbaza.